Welcome to another episode of Tech Tidbits, where we dive deep into everything tech, from the quirky to the innovative. I'm your host, and today we're exploring a rather amusingly deceptive yet creative tool that's been making waves among developers and GitHub users alike. Yes, I'm talking about generating a spiffy GitHub contributions graph that could impress your friends or maybe even your boss. Now, before we go any further, I want to put out a little disclaimer. This isn't about cheating. Cheating is, well, let's just say it's not a great look. But if someone is judging your capabilities based solely on that little graph in your GitHub profile, well, it's only fair to show them a rich graph, right? So what does this GitHub contributions graph look like? Picture a bland, almost despondent looking graph. We're talking sad faces, emoji wise. It's like the mood of a rainy Tuesday afternoon. But after running this script, boom, you've transformed it into a dazzling display of activity, like a vibrant festival. You've got muscles flexed, smiles, fireworks, and so many other fun emojis that tell a much more positive and engaging story about your coding journeys. All right, let's talk about how you can make this happen. The first step is straightforward. Create an empty GitHub repository. Don't initialize it just yet. Then you'll want to download the contribute.py script and run a simple command. Just type in python contribute.py repository git at github.com user slash repo dot git. And voila, you now have a repository filled with a plethora of changes. Just a heads up, it might take a few minutes for GitHub to re-index all that shiny new activity. Give it a little time, you know? Now, how does this all work? Well, the script cleverly initializes an empty Git repository, creates a text file, and generates changes to that file for every single day within the past year. We're looking at anywhere from 0 to 20 commits each day. Isn't that wild? And here's a fun feature. If you want to keep this new repository just for your eyes, you can make it private. That means others can see that you've contributed something but can't dive into the specifics of what it entails. It's like putting a do not disturb sign on your creative work. What if you're thinking, hey, I want a little more control over this? No problem. You can customize the script to dictate how often to commit or how many commits you make per day. For example, if you want to commit from 1 to 12 times a day, that's totally doable with another simple command. And if you're not party-eyeing on weekends, you can use the No Weekends option to keep your activity calendar neat and tidy. Let's not forget about troubleshooting. If after running the script, your activity seems unchanged, don't panic. Sometimes it takes a few minutes for GitHub to reflect those updates. And if you're using a private repository, ensure that your settings are adjusted to show private contributions, just to make sure everything displays as it should. Now, if you're listening in and thinking, this sounds a little too good to be true, remember, consistency and patience are key in this game. And if you find yourself facing issues, making sure your GitHub email matches the one in your local settings can often clear things right up. As we wrap things up today, it's fascinating to see how something as simple as a script can create such a colorful masterpiece on your GitHub profile. Just remember to balance fun with integrity in your coding journey. So whether you're aiming for a robust contributions graph or simply leveraging tools that enhance your digital presence, keep experimenting, keep coding, and keep smiling. That's all for today's episode of Tech Tidbits. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next one. Keep those codes clean and those graphs sparkling.